So I just wanted him in the gym. Um, a lot of minutes last night. We got four and five coming up. Um, and this way I can assure that we leave from the airport on time. <laughs> I get him here first, so I thought it was a good move. What did you, um, among that which you talked about yesterday, was did you talk at all about the, the stuff that went on, the yapping? I know it's been an issue in the past with Yeah, you but you know, I thought both teams did it. I didn't think it was a, a one-way street. I don't even know if we started it, to be honest. Um, I thought it was pretty much harmless talk too by both guys, you know, both teams. You know, at the end, LeBron and Tony got into talking about who knows what. Um, it did take 10 seconds out of my 20 seconds of the timeout, uh, <laughs> which is probably good. You know, who knows? But uh, you know, I don't know. It. Uh, I thought it was two teams that, that got very competitive. Uh, you know, it's funny. You never know how those games are going to go, and it just turned into a. You can see it early, even though we were up. You can see that the competition level was extremely high, and the tension level in that game was extremely high. And as a coach, I, I loved it because you, know, you don't get a lot of those, uh, especially this late. So I thought it was everything about that was good. Have you addressed anything with Rashid since yesterday? No, we just talked about the situation and uh, you know trying to control yourself and uh, understanding that you know at the end of the day. Uh, when stuff like that happens, even if you think you're in the right, um, you're still in the wrong because it hurts the team. Uh, but Rashid's emotional, he's been emotional, and, and you know, some of that won't change. Uh, you know, Rondos was a bad one as well, late in the fourth quarter, yeah. even. Uh, that may have been in some ways worse than sometimes, but um, it was a game of decks, both teams, and uh, you know, it happens. I'm not sure how you look at it. Why she was upset about it? Uh, yeah, I do. Which is, so I'm not going to get into that, but I do know what he was upset about. So it sounds like he was sort of justified and was just kind of acting out. I'm not going anywhere near that, but uh, I do know what he was upset about. Can you understand, though, that it, that it seems a little unseemly when, you know, a coach and player, or, you know, I mean, I, I'm not sure how you take it or no. you can accept it or whatever. but, it, but I can accept that. You okay. know, it happens.